I've been a part of the Webflow Experts program for over two years. Here's my review and some answers to the most common questions that I see. So benefits of the program, just as an overview, number one is leads. That was my only goal in participating in the program. I wanted more leads for my web design and web flow development business. I'll talk about more specific numbers in just a second. There's also some networking benefits by joining the program. There's a Slack channel, or at least there was, I don't know if it still exists, where you could find new leads, you could connect with other web flow professional partners. There was also some internal meetings where only professional partners could participate in. I didn't really participate in those, but those were also some added benefits. And then the last one is credibility. You get to add a badge to your website and you to call yourself a Webflow professional partner. There is a little bit of confusion confusion in that, but I'll talk about that in just a second. So back to the leads, I get on average one lead per month or even less than that. I have talked to other professional partners and heard from them who say that they get a lot more than one lead, potentially five, 10 or 15 per month. Now that may depend on location and the the services that they offer, but I can't really speak for them. So I'll just speak for myself. The leads in general are higher quality than you would see from Upwork or Fiverr, but they're not all super high quality. Some of the leads people will basically just reach out to five or 10 different Webflow developers and they're just shopping around for the cheapest price. I generally don't move forward with those projects, but there are some really high quality clients who are reaching out and generally those are the people who come to my website so we can either get a lead through the webflow experts program you get like an email notification you they say hey so and so is looking uh, to hire you for a project are you interested in meeting up with them or moving forward with the project and you just click yes or no other people will come directly to my website and those are the clients that I really want to work with because they're doing the research. They're not just throwing out a bunch of, you know, they're not just throwing around five or 10 different uh, requests. They're just look, they're looking for someone who they really want to work with. Another quick note before I get into the next topic, there were some design changes about a year ago with the experts program and also some other changes that gave us as professional partners, the ability to edit our profiles. I wanna say, I really like those changes. I like the ability that I can go in and make those changes myself without having to email the experts program. So just a quick note. Now I wanna say, this is not me complaining. These are just some things that I think could be improved about the program. Number one is the branding of the program. It's called the Webflow Experts Program, right? But you are called a Webflow Professional Partner. Now each Webflow Professional Partner is reviewed by Webflow's experts team. I don't know exactly who's reviewing them, but they have a team that review all the applications to join the program. The reason why this can be a little bit confusing is because I've seen people calling themselves Webflow experts, but they're not actually a professional partner. What happens is they take the Webflow certificate exam and the branding of those exams make it seem like it's okay to call yourself a Webflow expert. And I'm not calling out anyone who's calling themselves an expert, but I do think it's a little bit confusing when Webflow experts or professional partners are calling themselves Webflow experts, and then random people are also calling them Webflow experts. So I think this is just a super minor thing that could be fixed. Also, there is a ranking algorithm that supposedly ranks certain professional partners above others. One of those things that they look at is the time it takes to respond to notifications or project requests. Are they just looking for time to respond or is there other things they're looking for? So that's one thing I would love to know more about. And then the third and final thing, again, I'm not completely Complaining, but this is just something that I've experienced. It can be kind of difficult to find information about the program. There's the public information. So there's a public page where you can apply to the Webflow Experts program. But as an internal professional partner, I sometimes can get confused on where exactly like my dashboard is. I know that there is a form where people can ask questions and connect with other Webflow professional partners, but it does not seem very active. And I don't think people go on there very often. There used to be a Slack channel and I spent about half hour to 45 minutes trying to find that. And I don't know if that still exists or not. Um, and I looked through a bunch of different emails, couldn't find information about it. So I think there, there could be a central place of like know-how or places where we can find all of the information like our uh, referral link, uh, the link to how to edit our profile, um, j just basically a central hub to be able to find that information. And maybe the location of that form is actually what that's supposed to be. I don't know. Let's get to the last two things. Number one, is it worth it? I would say absolutely it is worth it. You get leads from the par program, it's free. You don't really have to do anything outside of just remain an active business, keep your profile up to date, make sure your website isn't down, that sort of thing. So it absolutely is worth it. But one thing I do wanna say is, don't wait to become a Webflow professional partner 
in order for your business to be successful because your business isn't just magically going to be successful when you join the program. I thought like, man, once I join the partner program, I'm going to get lots of leads. I'm going to sell lots of websites. I get a few. Yeah. And some of them turn into business, but in reality, I would probably be very close to where I'm at right now. I made a video about this about two years ago and my thoughts are the exact same. Do not wait to join the Webflow Professional Partner Program to you know, be successful. You can do it without joining the program. Their review process can take quite a while and there's a lot of people at this point who are trying to get in. So um, don't, don't be like, oh, if I don't get in, I'm not gonna be successful. Uh, like I, I can't stress that enough. And if I were to go back two years before I joined, I would tell myself the exact same thing. So I hope this video is helpful. Uh, we'll see you in the next one. Bye.